everyone what's up what's going on welcome or welcome back to my channel i am seiko marley if you're new here and you haven't subscribed yet go ahead and click that subscribe button in today's video i'll be showing you guys how i style my wash and go so this is right after a fresh wash And I'll just start by sectioning off the top and bottom half. The bottom half of my hair is more thick than the top half. So I'll just go ahead and detangle that real quick. This brush is called Tangle Free by Kala. And as you can see, I don't use any combs or anything like that to section off my hair. I'll just use my finger. And I'll add some moisture with this continuous spray bottle. You can get this bottle from the link in the description box. I'll put it down below. And you can use Seiko 5 as a coupon code for money off. Once I've sectioned off my hair, that one section I'm working on, I'll go ahead and detangle it some more. And I'll do an even mixture between the Holy Grail Wetline Extreme Gel. I love this gel so much. I've been using this gel ever since I switched from Eco. Love Wetline, it stops frizz for me. It reduces shrinkage a lot. I have a lot of shrinkage and this is just the best gel that I've used so far. If you guys have any recommendations on gels that you use, if you have a lot of shrinkage like me, put it in the comment section down below i'll love to try it and film it for you guys so once i feel like it's an even consistency between the gel and the water it should be a little slimy but still wet and i'll use the brush to make sure that the gel and water are evenly distributed throughout my hair and I'll go ahead and start separating strands and giving it a little twirl around my finger so that the curl can drop. And I'll just do this for the entire section. So now that one side is done, I'll go ahead and add some bobby pins so that I can keep the part flat. And now you guys can compare what's already done to the process of what I'm doing to get it to look like that side. We'll just do the same method, adding water and gel evenly. Look at that curl beautiful I love this gel so much I wish I had a lifetime supply now if you're new here and you don't know I've been natural for two years I big chopped February 2018, we're now in 2020, I've grown all this hair in two years, and if you don't believe me, you can go back to the first video I ever uploaded of my natural hair journey on my channel, and you can see how short I, I cut my hair in 2018, I thought I was bald. I was a bit regretful at first, but in two years, taking good care of your hair and feeding it, giving it the moisture it needs, your hair will grow pretty quick. Time will fly, you won't even notice. That's basically what happened to me. I can't wait for it to grow some more. I'm excited for the next two years to see how long my hair gets.
also if you guys don't follow me on instagram you should do that right after this video ends there will be a link down below follow me on instagram at i am seiko marley and if you haven't been following me on instagram then you wouldn't wouldn't know that i have launched my new website it's i am seiko marley.com you guys can go check it out the link will also be down below for my site I have tons of hair care ebooks detangling masks deep conditioning masks all type of stuff that you guys might need tips and tricks how to test your hair porosity how to manage low porosity hair those are all books that you can get from my site they're available for purchase right now so go check it out So we have one section left and I'm just going to use an extra long bobby pin to take the hair out of my face so I can be able to see and I'll just go in and stretch the hair with my fingers just to make sure that there's no gel that may be clogged close to my roots. And now we're going to do the edges. I didn't show it in the video, but the edge control that I'm using here is by Cara Care. And it's a coconut oil based edge control. It has good hold. And I'm just going to use that and style my edges. If you guys want me to do a video specifically on how I do my edges for certain hairstyles, let me know in the comment section below. So now I'm going to go in with my pick and just lightly stretch my hair out, give it some volume, make sure that as the hair was sitting, the layers do not get stuck together with the gel. And you'll see that I used the pick and my hand at the same time. And now I'll go in with my fingers to stretch the gel from the center section to my ends, the ends that may not have gotten gel to reach. And this is what makes sure my style lasts long because the ends have been encased in gel. And this is the final look. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. Stay tuned for my refreshing video where I refresh this exact style that I just showed you on day three hair. So that style will be coming up next. Make sure your post notifications are on or that you're following me on Instagram so you'll be notified when I do post my next video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Leave a comment, give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already subscribed. Bye.